Hey, how's it going, everybody? Uh, this weekend, my cousin and I went on some uh, toy hunt and was able to pick up some few things. These two uh, figures here I got from the collector's event toy show. Um, it was like a mini one that they put on this week, this this weekend. I uh, got some pretty good deals. Got the Iron Monger Marvel the Legend ones, uh, and then I got Ant Man. These were all, these were both ten bucks, and I gotta say I got Ant Man for a really good deal. Um, this wasn't when I went there. Uh, this this one was the Iron Monger was in the box, and uh, that guy was like everything in the box here was ten bucks each, and uh, I got this guy, and uh, the the guy there gave it to me for ten bucks also. So that's a really good deal. I've always wanted one. Our our shop, our um, hobby shop here had an Ant Man, but the price was too high. So, man, I, I was very excited when he said that he was gonna give this to me for ten bucks. So, um, I picked up, uh, picked up up right away. I was very excited when I got him. So here is the Iron Monger. Sorry for the light here, but there was this one, and then there was the blue, uh, the blue variant also. It only it had the blue uh, chest light here, and the eyes were blue. So. Um, I'm probably gonna open this one and do a uh, custom on it and uh, make the paint look better because this paint here is pretty dull, as you can see. A very heavy figure though, so very nice. And then uh, we got Ant Man here, a very nice figure. And this is one build a figure to build this uh, giant man, so it's very nice. Here are the other figures that come in that line. You can see there. All right, so here is Ant Man again, and this is one of the the older Marvel Legends build a figure ones. Here you go. It comes with the, uh, um, I think that's uh, the um, right arm. So comes with the right arm there. All right, so we got those there, and then uh, went to picked up a few of the uh, Transformers line here got this one here let's uh zoom this in so I picked up this one here sandstorm really wanted a sandstorm I got the other uh, 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 Springer and uh, I got Blitzwing so I needed a uh, sandstorm so I picked this one up very nice nice uh, figure indeed um, here is the bio if you guys want to read that or not just pause and read that if you like here are the uh, triple changer that it comes into robot, and then the doom buggy and the um, the uh, air airplane, whatever that one is. Here is the artwork of it, and here it is. Very nice uh, figure. Can't wait to get this opened up. Also, uh, uh, this play against the other two. All right, picked up a waspinator. Yes. I'm very excited I got Waspinator. He was one of the uh, characters uh, that I enjoyed when I was watching Beast Wars back in the days. Um, but here he is. Here's the artwork. Back here is the uh, bio. If you want to read that, you can. Uh, here is the Wasp mold and the uh, robot mold. So a very good. Uh, this figure is looks a lot more cleaner and more nicer. So here it is. Then picked up the other one that came out with it, Skids, and he's loaded with all these weapons and things, so it's very, very nice. It's in blue uh, artwork. Here's the back of this. You can read that if you like and pause. Here's the car mode and the robot mode. Again, a very nice, nice figure. Can't wait to uh, get this one open also and display them in my other generations line. Check this out, and uh, we'll do a close up here. Sorry for the glare, guys, but uh, I'll try the best I can. All right, next, picked up this one here. I got the uh, Batman Arkham Asylum Deathstroke from that uh, line, and uh, I'm not much of a, a DC uh, collector person. Um, I don't know, I'm not much of a fan of it, but 
I mean, I like Deathstroke. He's pretty cool. So I uh, picked this guy up. He has a lot of accessories also. And that's another thing why I liked it. And here is the back of the artwork here. You can read this here if you like. I'll pause it there. Here is the artwork itself. And uh, the other figures that come in that line. Here's another bio there. But I guess yeah, I really like this uh, Deathstroke figure. Um, I don't know. I, I like it. It's just I wish they would have made the legs and hips here a little bigger. It looks like it's got it's big here and it is goes skinny here. So other than that, I mean, and also the uh, articulation is kind of limited on the hips and uh, thighs there. So it can only, I think I believe it only goes uh, back and front and back for his legs. All right, and I got. This one here, Marvel Legends Jean Grey, a very nice, nice figure. It comes with it, and this is part of the uh, Rocket Raccoon Builder figure. So there it is, the uh, body and I believe it's a tail. That's a tail. But here is the artwork itself. A nice artwork. Here is the figure itself. Check that out. Here's the back. There's a phoenix in the back there, and there she is. Here's a uh, information about her, and the rest of the line. I really want the, that that one there. That is one of the wrecking crew that I want, and I also want Black Panther. So there you go. Very nice, very nice haul. Again, just wanna just wanna share some of the hauls that I that I picked up this weekend and. Uh, I've had a pretty fun uh, weekend with my cousins and uh, enjoying the family time. And so it was very nice. Went to a nice event and uh, enjoy every moment of it. Alright, so here is my haul for the week. And uh, I was very happy I got all these guys here. Alright, check them out. And uh, I'll see everybody later. All right. Take care.